We are now facing a situation in which we have to make choices, whether we like it or not. Our decision on which direction to choose from here should be based on the evidence that has been gathered. The Plan for Blue project looks at four alternative scenarios for how our choices will affect people and the marine nature and change the ways the sea areas in the Gulf of Finland and the Archipelago Sea are used now and in the future. The direction of unlimited growth means that there will be little regulation. Fossil energy will be used without much consideration and without investments in renewable energy. The sea areas will be congested with cargo vessels, fishing boats and tourists. The sea will become polluted and polluting activities will threaten wild species. We can also head for a digitalized world in which extensive digitalization reduces the need for transport, among other things. Vessels will sail without crews and virtual travel will replace traditional tourism. More energy will be needed and it will be produced from renewable sources. The circular economy and locally grown food, for example the cultivation of algae, will be important. However, we can't be sure about all the advantages and disadvantages of a digitalized future yet. For example, will we be able to produce enough renewable energy? In the third scenario, people live sustainably. This means strict environmental regulation and zero emission vessels. Responsible tourists go only to permitted areas and enjoy locally grown food in the spirit of the circular economy. In this future, energy is produced from renewable sources. If it feels difficult to make decisions, we will continue just like we have until now. We will keep on chopping and changing without a shared goal. We will use renewable and fossil energy side by side. We will consume and travel more and more, even though we worry about the state of the planet Earth. Which direction would you choose? More information is available in the Plan for Blue Alternative Scenarios for Energy Production, Maritime Tourism, the Blue Bioeconomy and the Maritime Cluster and in the project reports. Plan for Blue, the sustainable direction of blue growth.